honestly, most importantly, I'm grateful to you. Every, every single one of you. I am... I'm so grateful. I remember... I remember when we started the show, we couldn't get enough people to fill an audience. <laughs> and you know, I, I always think it's good. That's how comedy is, funny enough. I remember all my shows, people didn't... There weren't tickets, at, you know, everyone... Just, there were empty seats. Um, and, then I, and then I look at this now, I don't take it for granted, ever. Every seat that has ever been filled to watch something that I'm doing, I always appreciate, because I know the empty seat that sits behind it. So thank you. Thank you to the people who watch, the people who share the clips, you know? Everyone who's had an opinion. Everyone who's been kind enough and gracious enough to, you know, whether even if it's a critique, it doesn't even have to be praised, but some people who watch, I don't like it when you do this, but I, but I watch. I want to say I appreciate those people. Even the people who hate watched, we still got the ratings, thank you. <laughs> I'm eternally grateful to you. And uh, this is random for some, but special shout out to, to black women. Um, <laughs> I... You know, I've, I've been... I've often been credited with, you know, having these grand ideas of people like, oh, Trevor, you're so smart, and you're so... And then, like, I'm like, who do you think teaches me? You know? Who do you think has shaped me, nourished me, informed me? You know, from my mom, my grand, you know, my aunt, all these black women in my life. But then, in America as well, if you... I always tell people, if you truly want to learn about America, talk to black women. Yeah. Because, unlike everybody else, black women cannot afford to f around and find out. <laughs> black people understand how hard it is when things go bad, especially in America, but any place where black people exist, whether it's Brazil, whether it's South Africa, wherever it is, when things go bad, black people know that it gets worse for them. But black women in particular, they know what shit is, genuinely. People always be shocked. They'll be like, why do what, black women turn out the way they do in America? Why do they vote the way... They, yeah, because they know what happens if things do not go the way it should. They cannot afford to f around and find out. And to black women who have taught me, all of them, I mean, the scholars online, the, you know, the authors, everybody, the Roxanne Gays, the Tressie McMillan Cottoms, the, you know, I'll remember the names, you know, the Zoe Tamudzis, the, like, brilliant, brilliant women taken the time to inform me, to educate me, to argue with me, you know? The Tarana Burks who, you know, laughed with me, talking about everything from sexual assault to just what life is like. Yeah, man, I'll tell you now, do yourself a favor. You truly want to know what to do or how to do it, or maybe the best way or the most, the most equitable way? Talk to black women. They, uh, they're a lot of the reason that I'm here, and so I'm grateful to them. I'm grateful to every single one of you. This has been an honor. Thank you. <laughs>